Unveiling Secrets, Get the Inside Scoop. Hello, everyone. Welcome back to our channel, where we make English learning easy and fun. Today, we're going to dive into a very interesting phrase that you might have heard before. Get the inside scoop. Stick around as we explore what it means, how you can use it, and why it's a useful expression to add to your English vocabulary. The phrase, get the inside scoop, means to obtain exclusive or privileged information about something that is not widely known by the public. It's like being part of a small group of people who know a secret or have information that others do not. The word, scoop, in this context refers to news or information, especially if it is obtained before anyone else. Interestingly, the origin of this phrase comes from the world of journalism. A scoop is a term journalists use to describe exclusive news obtained before their competitors. So, when you get the inside scoop, it's as if you're getting exclusive news directly from the source, before it becomes common knowledge. This phrase is commonly used in casual and professional conversations alike. You might hear it in various contexts, such as when talking about company news, celebrity gossip, or even secret recipes. To help you better understand how to use, get the inside scoop. Let's look at some examples. 1. I managed to get the inside scoop on the new cafe opening downtown. They're going to have a secret menu for regular customers. 2. Do you want to get the inside scoop on how to ace the interview? My cousin works in HR and gave me some great tips. 3. Everyone was surprised by the announcement, but I had already gotten the inside scoop from a friend in the know. These examples show how you can use the phrase in different situations to express having privileged information. When you want to use, get the inside scoop, remember that it conveys a sense of exclusivity and insight. It's perfect for situations where you're sharing or receiving information that's not commonly available. Here are a few tips. Use it to express excitement about knowing something special. It can be a great conversation starter or a way to intrigue your listener. Be mindful of the context. It's more suited to informal or semi-formal settings. And there you have it. You now know how to get the inside scoop on using this fascinating phrase. It's a great way to express that you have exclusive information and can add a layer of interest to your conversations. We hope this video has been insightful and that you'll feel confident using Get the Inside Scoop in your English conversations. Thanks for watching, and don't forget to practice what you've learned today. See you in the next video.